Hello and welcome to Huma Comedy Presents Sunday Roast. You join us again on a Sunday because this is when we do the Sunday Roast because that's how it works. And um, you join us with two new victims for the roast. We have Khan Johnson and Wayne Griffith. Say hello, you two. Hello, you two. Lovely. What? Good. Right, someone turned Khan's hair and aid up. Um, if you don't know the rules, where have you been? Uh, we're going to have uh, two comedians sling five jokes slash insults at each other, and then you have till nine o'clock tonight to vote for your favourite on the comment section below. B- b- below. Um, yeah, that's that's how that works. Um, so we'll we'll just say hello. We'll say hello to Khan first. Hi, Khan. How you doing? Well, good. Um, how have you how have you prepared for this one, old boy? What? What are we doing here? I didn't ask for this. <laughs> just, just when c- coming on a Sunday morning, he said, "Just have a nice chat." He says, "Suddenly, I'm getting questions. I didn't ask for questions." Um, for those at home watching, this is um, Khan's doing what's called acting. Um, he, he's fully aware of what this is, and this is recorded on a Friday night anyway, so he's full of shit. Um, I'm, hey, I'm... you said we're doing a Sunday roast. Be the on brand. Is dead. The the is dead. Going on. <laughs> I'm, to be honest, as you are a resident Huma vegan, I'm, I'm surprised you've mustered the energy to come and uh, come and do this. Anyway, so that's that's Why, my friend. Why? Why? <laughs> Why? Um, how have you how, how have you prepared for the for the roast with Wayne? How have you what have you what have you done? Have you had some? Uh, I, I basically went and went and shouted at puppies. Okay. Right. Because they and, just seem like the same sort of thing. And not the cute puppy, you know, the really sort of weird, oddball Disney one at the back of the pack that runs along and trips <laughs> over its own ears. The one you kind of feel sorry for, but you know he's going to die. It's gone dark. Very <laughs> dark. And animal based. He's killing animals. It's, it, it, he's killing a man. I didn't kill the animal. In, in the story, the animal <laughs> dies. <laughs> Mate, I can what? No, I didn't kill Bambi's mum. Spoiler alert Bambi's mum <laughs> dies. Um, for God's sake, don't watch Old Yeller. I didn't have any, <laughs> but you know, equally, I didn't push the stuff over the cliff. I was just, you know, standing yeah. nearby, not helping. And uh, we have Wayne Griffiths. We'll move swiftly on. Um, how, how are you doing, Wayne? How have you prepared for this one? It's been really hard to prepare, to be honest. I've uh, I've been homeschooling a nine year old, which has made it really difficult to get in my morning wank. Uh, <laughs> not, not impossible, but difficult. Which is it's also weird in the fact that I don't have any children. So, uh, <laughs> but other than that, uh, yeah, it's been all right. Yeah, I've uh, I've prepared. I've got notes and everything. So, <laughs> oh, nice, you are prepared. That's lovely. I mean, yeah, it's, it's 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 weird this because you are you are a Tottenham Hot Spurs fan. You are a Spurs fan, so yeah. you'll be used to sort of um, trying your best and not quite succeeding and putting the pressure on. That's the main thing. Just applying pressure. Uh, abs- so, a lifetime of disappointment. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, he's, I'm an orange he's man, just so. happy to turn up and be part of the occasion. <laughs> Every game's I'm, a cup final for me. And I'm just at the bottom of the screen shouting, wishing to be heard. Um, that's <laughs> kind of... Sorry, we can't, we can't quite hear you all the way up here at the top. What, what that? <laughs> Strongest team in the division, holding everyone else up. That's what we're doing. Um, yeah. Lovely. Cool. Right, shall we crack on? I think, I think we said uh, Wayne will go first. So, Wayne, do you want to take it away? Yeah, I was, uh, I was really looking forward to a, a roast today. Then someone invited a fucking vegan. <laughs> uh, they say that veganism is a lot like communism they're both okay as long as you don't like food <laughs> it's, the, it's to be fair it's the ex- most excited i've been since they reopened kfc during the lockdown or as khan calls it the place that he gets his sweet corn and bean bucket so <laughs> i've heard it called worse my friend i've heard it called worse <laughs> uh, as you probably noticed there wayne is obviously reading from notes so i'm going to be doing the same cunt there we go um <laughs> <laughs> I wrote. I, so we, we have we have planned this. I know people think it's just you know a bit of sparring, but we had a little chat about what we could take the piss out of, what we couldn't take the piss out of, and we wrote a few things down. Wayne did his early in the week because he plans. I did mine half an hour ago, uh, and I can't read my own writing. See, I'm not generally a fan of comedy roast as a rule. If I wanted to spend my time hurling insults at morons, I'd stay on Facebook. <laughs> Right. Martin said it would be fun and he'd get someone good to have a go up against and clearly they were busy as well I've been left with the less talented half of Norfolk's only Jedward tribute act <laughs> which is fair we're called Wayward we do christenings bar mitzvahs wakes anything really uh, I don't know. <laughs> and, all, and all from the downstairs loo which is lovely Absolutely. well see Khan is one of the few people it doesn't matter which way you, you put his head it, it, it pretty much looks exactly the same <laughs> 
he once told me that the hardest part of being a vegan was shutting the fuck up about it. So, uh, and an interesting fact about vegan is there's no such thing as a cheesy vegan joke. So, uh, <laughs> I'm just really, really touched, and not in that way, that you have actually printed off a picture of me that big to help with your morning. I printed work. off two. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that, that picture's not life size though, is it, Wayne? Okay. <laughs> you had to enlarge that to make it fit on the picture. Uh, right. Insult two. Cunt. No? Uh, I like a running joke because, you know, Wayne can't really run. Um, I don't often mention the fact I'm vegan. I tend to leave that to uh, other people like Wayne or tell you for me. Uh, but that, this does put me at a disadvantage in a roast because as a vegan, I'm not allowed to be cruel to dumb animals. Or intelligent ones. Not that that's an issue here. So, <laughs> To be fair, he only mentions he's vegan on days that end in a Y um, or on the Facebook page that he himself runs. So other than that, he barely, <laughs> he barely ever mentions it. Ow, hang on, hang on. Whoa, I run one page that mentions the word vegan everywhere. I run about seven others that don't. So <laughs> on balance. Yeah, you do well. <laughs> yeah, I only mentioned it one, one occasion in seven. <laughs> Well, I've never been quite sure if Khan is uh, of mixed race or just needs a really good wash. <laughs> if he is mixed race, he's the paciest, pastiest mixed race fellow I've ever seen. It's like he's part Indian, part ghost. <laughs> he is, in fact, an Ill illegitimate love child of Boris. I don't know if you've noticed his surname. It was from that time <laughs> when Boris fucked a giant rat. But to be fair, the giant rat went on to race four Ninja Turtles, and uh, so it wasn't all bad. So <laughs> <laughs> That's very, very true. It's all, it's all true. I can't, I can't deny any of that. Boris is my dad, and it's all my fault. However, <laughs> I, I'm not the one with you know, the Borisy hair. So Boris does get around, and it turns out Wayne and I are, are related. Although we are in Norfolk, so that kind of just goes with the brand. Almost, almost positively, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, mean, I, I, I feel bad doing this, genuinely, because I, I've, I've known Wayne for a while. He's, he's generally an all right kind of guy and someone you don't mind spending 10 minutes with. Um but he has had a hard time of late. I mean, he's usually busy gigging, but obviously with the event that we're all living through at the moment, uh, that's kind of all gone to hell. Which is a shame because with his fair hair and his pale skin, he's always been a real hit at his local pub's regular area night. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, because if Hitler had one, I would have been his bitch easily. I wouldn't have had any problems with it. <laughs> and to be fair, Hitler's best mate is running that pub, so... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh... <laughs> See, Carl's that greedy. The, he's not happy with one sclerosis. He has to have multiples of them. Uh, I've, 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 I once saw him walk into a bar, followed by a stool and a table uh, and a wall. Um, and it wasn't until I met him that you know I, I realised that, that MS has an awful lot of symptoms, but one of them is being a cunt. So <laughs> it's just not a symptom. A warning on this one, I think. Usually I don't have to, but this one I'm putting a parental guidance fucking hell. <laughs> it's it's look being being a cunt is not a thing to do with MS. It's just an added bonus that I can be, and you can't have a go at me about it. Um, <laughs> can we just point out at this point? I think it's relevant that I am actually covered by the Disability Discriminations Act, which means you can't have a go at me. So, ha, fuck off. <laughs> this entire rose is now discrimination. Uh, which one have we done? I've done that one. I've done that one. Uh, oh, there! Oh, oh! I don't know which. Uh, would you like? Do you want insult four or insult five? Oh, lucky dip! Uh, four. Let's go with four. Oh, let's go with four because that's next. <laughs> I mean, comedy is really struggling at the moment, and not just because of the lack of gigs. Obviously, a number of male acts have been outed recently as sex pests, uh, but that won't happen with Wayne. That won't happen at all because he's protected by having a joint Facebook account. <laughs> that's a symbol for do that again, they'll cut your balls off. <laughs> it's a, to be fair, it's a touchy subject because uh, I did have just before lockdown a vasectomy. It did take three hours. He did tell me I had an awkward scrotum, and we did go for drinks afterwards. So uh, <laughs> he was a lovely surgeon. <laughs> he wasn't a surgeon, mate. <laughs> uh, explain it. That's just what he told people. He's been arrested now. <laughs> See, I, I, I promised that I wouldn't do this, but I thought. Martin's not really out of pop at him yet as the host from what I've seen in these rows. So I just want to say, Martin, that Khan's com comedy career is very much like your mum's sex life. Perform performing to sparse rooms full of strangers, ultimately unfulfilling uh, and filled full of drunk men that have made bad life choices. So uh... <laughs> I, 
like the fact that it wasn't really a pop at me, it was a pop at my mum. And uh, yeah. to be fair, all of that was true. So, Everyone loves um, a mum joke, do you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> no. yeah, she has been dead for six years, but thanks for bringing that up, Wayne. Yeah, lovely. Right, that's um, move a lot, mate. <laughs> I had to break it to you, Martin, but she hasn't. She just, just she's just not talking to you. <laughs> she's not returning my calls. Yeah, again. Yeah. I mean, it's, you know, it's a bit harsh having a go at Martin's mum, you know, because she doesn't know who you are. But like most. <laughs> no, she's never seen my face. To be fair, with the balaclava on, most of us haven't. So. <laughs> Do your last fucking joke, you. <laughs> all right, should we crack on? Uh, all right, that's this one. Um, I think this is the last one I wrote. Not many people know that Wayne has a knack for getting famous people to send messages to his friends. Some would say it's blackmail, but, you know, let's be, just gloss over that. And it's actually the only reason he has friends. It also meant that he was the least interesting part of the one best man speech he's ever given. <laughs> Not that that will come as a surprise to anyone who's seen him try and do stand-up. <laughs> I'd like to come back to that, but it's fair. I can't. There's nothing. <laughs> I mean, it hurts, but it's fair. I <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. I, I think that was, that was five. That was nice. Well, well done. That was that was um, varied. Um, it was it was nice. It was good. Thanks. Yeah. thanks I mean, for I was like to contest there. the mixed race thing. I'm not mixed race. I was strictly a 400 meter person at school. Well, d- just stop looking uh, like it. I don't. I, <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Wait. in this day and age you can ask someone to stop looking mixed race. I don't think that's that is fine. It, I mean, it's it's very on brand for now. Over <laughs> Try stop and look. We miss well, nothing, then if all not, the races will just stop going on about it. But you know, well, nothing is not controversial and current. Do you know what I mean? I don't want to. I mean, Wayne's just a bit fed up at the moment because his 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 core act has been completely ripped apart by the whole Black Lives Matter thing. The Al Jolson tribute act in drag has gone. <laughs> I can't do that. Anymore. I even grew my own boobs. <laughs> that was nice. And a very fine pair they are, sir. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Right. Anyway, admin. Um, so that was that was that was the five. That was the five. If you, uh, just vote for your favourite by nine o'clock tonight on the original post below. Da, 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 da. Um, lovely. Good. Uh, the numbers are on screen now. I think we'll we'll do a, a stars and rise thing. I say stars and rise because I'm, I'm just making it current for you two. Um, <laughs> tonight, so, Matthew. I'm going to attempt to be an MC on a video podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not attempting, I am. Let, come on, let me do his admin. Oh, oh sorry, on, the admin. Yeah, admin. That's the yes. important bit. Um, lovely, good, right. Um, some some Huma stuff coming up. We've got we've got a new episode of the podcast coming up, so so listen out for that. Um, also, the 27th of July is Norfolk Day in the county of S- Norfolk. And um, to celebrate that, we are, we're doing an online festival where we're going to put loads of videos of stand up and sketches and just ramblings from local comedians throughout the day. So just check in then on the 27th of July throughout the day and you'll be able to see some funny stuff. Um, yeah, vote for your favourite 9 o'clock. Well, by 9 o'clock tonight on the, on the bits below. Um, go outside, go applaud these two comedians. We don't do the NHS clap anymore, so we can at least give these two the clap, although they look like they've already got it. Um, I got it from Wayne. Yeah. I th- it's like mum. <laughs> she's clean um and uh all right that's enough for, enough for the mum stuff just but you're not too old to yes you are and um yes uh give it up one more time for con johnson and wayne griffiths um i've been martin westgate we'll see you later goodbye